So we're at this restaurant, Kayla Lily, and uh, we came across this sign, and I just find it really irritating and silly how people try to glamorize wage slavery. And you know, they're almost saying it as like a good thing, like you know, begin your daughter's or son work career. And work is not a good thing. It takes up an exceptional amount of time. Half of a person's waking life goes to work. And most people would quit their jobs if they didn't have to work. So I think it's really, you know, just, just the way they promote this, and that this is a good thing. A good people, work ethic. People work because they have to. A good work ethic will um, be taught. <laughs> but, so there's no, there's no point in glamorizing work. It's like glamorizing uh, chest pain or glamorizing <laughs> uh, back pain. The only reason people work 99.9% .9 of the time is because they have to. And um, I would hate to have a son or daughter that has to become an eventual wage slave. And, you know, good work ethic really starts at home. It doesn't start at your first job. And um, a lot of parents around here, they don't want their children working for, you know, menial wages, menial jobs. And unfortunately, there's a lot of um, need for their work because they're a part of society and the parents aren't sending them out to work. And and um, we have a, a great need for workers and, you know, they, Unfortunately, if you're born and you're of age, you have to serve society. That's just part of your job. This is the biggest oxymoron in a fun work environment. I mean, like <laughs> yeah. I said, nobody would work if they didn't have to. Yeah, it it's really does glamorize things. And, you know, it's just, it's just really pitiful that parents bring children into the world and they will have to work for a living. They are for, forced into work slavery.